Namaste programs, welcome back to Microsoft Flight Simulator and the road continues with the South England bush trip. Leg two today from Bristol to Eagle Scott, let's go, why don't we? Namaste programs and look, live weather on the bush trips, they don't tend to go together, especially when you have English weather. Look at this, it's absolutely pissing down. We're gonna have to fix that. Boom, done, let's try that again. programs now that that has magically sorted itself out as much as i do like to try and keep it as live weather as possible it's just no fun for me or for you to have the whole flight be gray and rainy and nothing to look at this is a tourist virtual tourist exercise after all let's try and get into the air and turn around uh, for 256 for 251. Western Supermare. Lift off from Bristol Airport and set a course to the west southwest and gain a visual on the Bristol Channel. Pass over the town of Western Supermare, located just inland of the channel between the River Banwell and the River Axe. Yes, Western Super Mare with two hyphens in it. I don't know if it's this whole town or just a little bit over to the left there. We seem to be above St. George's on the Google map and Keystroke off to the right. Keystroke, Q Stoke. There you go, said that perfectly wrong. And then Western Super Mare is just to our left here, sort of that whitish section almost industrial anyway haven't seen well that might be a cricket pitch over there that might be a football pitch there it's just not yeah you know, just little local ones not big stadiums or anything so i'll allow it i will allow it 187 for 252 block time bridgewater turn to the south and follow the coastline remaining just inland of the shore pass over the town of highbridge and the river brew then gain a visual on the river parrot P-A-R-R-E-T-T, -T, not Parrot. Bridgewater is located on the banks of the River Parrot. Well, this must be the River Parrot, not Parrot. Although, oh, cricket pitch off onto the right. There we go, because this is Bridgewater. The well-known from the previous, um, the, well, the thing I read out. That's where it's well-known from. Possibly some football fields there. Oh, yes, definitely some football fields. Anyway, the uh, Purple Arrow is being very insistent that we go 281 for 516. Yes, Purple Arrow. On our way to Dunster. The Dunster. Sounds like a nickname. Hey, mate. Yeah, you need to go down and see the Dunster. He'll sort you out. From Bridgewater, turn to the west-northwest and pass to the south of, of the Quantock Hills. Located just inland of the south shore of the Bristol Channel, the Quantock Hills were the first location in England to be designated an area of outstanding natural beauty. After passing the northern end of the Quantock Hills, follow the coastline of the Bristol Channel to the village of Dunster, located along the banks of the river, the river, the river Avil, the river Avil, the river, river, river Avil.
There it is, just along that river at the base of that hill, sort of just north of, or just up from the nose now, is Dunster, tiny little village. No sign of any kind of sporting facilities. Perhaps a bit of grass to run around in. That's about it. Over there on the coast is Mine Shaft, Mine Head. Mine Head, a little bit bigger. Um, now, I'd, oh yes, there we go, 282. We were going 281 and now we're doing 282. So it was possible the purple arrow was still pointing in the same direction. But there we go. 4 minutes 35, 282. Linton. Maintain course following the coastline of the southern Bristol Channel. Gain a visual on the East Lynn River and follow it to the town of Linton, located on the shore of the Bristol Channel. Well, that's apparently Linton on the cliff there. I'm not sure exactly what's going on there. I think maybe the uh, algorithm has done it a bit of a bit dirty, but maybe not. Maybe they're on that cliff like that. That's pretty cool if they are. An interesting little place. 224 for 348. Barnstaple. Turn to the southwest and sight the River Tor. Ta! Pass over the port town of Barnstaple where the River Tor ta! begins to widen as it enters the Bristol Channel. Welcome to Barn Staple. Well, if you need staples for your barn, it's the place to go. Uh, tennis courts maybe in front of us there. Football fields perhaps. Not seeing much cricket though. Barn Staple, you're, uh, you're letting the team down, mate. You're letting the team down. 165 for 254. Reset our clock on our way to Eagle Scott. At Barnstaple, turn onto a south southeast course and follow the general course of A337, a small highway, and stay it with a lift. Gain a visual on Eagle Scott Airfield, located west of A377, amid a patchwork of fields and stands of trees. Here it is, I found it. It was kind of hidden. Couldn't even tell if there was a runway facing this way, but there is. I think we might be coming in a bit fast and there's some trees in the road as always with these little ones. Algorithm plus. That's not how things work, but I think we'll be all right, maybe? Question mark, famous last words. Reasonably long bit of grass. Get our wheels down, get our brakes on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We can do it, we can do it, we can do it. We did it, we did it. Hidden in the middle of nowhere. Still, it's a runway. We've landed on it. That was leg three, leg two, leg three. One of the legs of the Southern England bush trip. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Thank you for existing. Au revoir, goodbye.